Hi, I'm Jack Pepin, and this is American Master at Home. In the early 50s, almost all of the 50s, I work at the Plaza Athene in Paris, a very big hotel too. At some point, I was the breakfast cook, and uh, in the morning we did a lot of French toast. To go faster, I used to use ice cream, that is vanilla ice cream. Of course, French vanilla ice cream is done with a lot of eggs. And uh, dip the bread in it and saute it. That's what I want to show you here. If you have a bit of a leftover uh, ice cream as I have here, uh, put it on a plate. I have a bowl of ice cream here. Uh, and uh, of course, let it melt. Uh, and maybe even put it in the microwave oven for like 10, 15 seconds. So now it's melted, of course. I have a big slice of bread here. I want to put it in there. And of course, I want to let it soak a couple of minutes so that it really absorbs all, uh, all of that ice cream. I mean, basically all of it. And in fact, what I do, I put it on there. I'm going to cook it. I'm going to keep that plate. And even if there is a bit of ice cream left over, I serve it on that plate anyway. So here, I need a good tablespoon of butter. So as you can see, basically, it whoop, absorbed basically all of it. I'm going to put it in there. Lower the heat. I want to cook that at low temperature, a couple of minutes on each side. I made my French toast here with the vanilla ice cream, but of course, the beauty of it, you can do it with strawberry ice cream, chocolate ice cream. It'd be a bit different for a French toast. <laughs> well, it should be about a couple of minutes here. It's very soft, the bread, because it really soaked a lot of the ice cream, you know. Cook it on this side again, a couple of minutes, then a bit of uh, maple syrup on top, and I have an old banana in my refrigerator, so I'll use it. I keep the banana in the refrigerator, they keep much longer, and they end up being all black, but they're still nice and creamy inside and firm. So it's one way of keeping them longer. It's about ready now. Maybe half of that banana would be good. Okay. So this is a, a different way of doing French toast. Quite good, and as you see, there is still a little bit of ice cream on top, which is fine, you know. This too, one piece for the chef. A little bit of uh, maple syrup. And here it is, my French toast, the easy way. Enjoy and happy cooking. Thank you for joining me. For more, subscribe to this channel or watch here. Thank you and happy cooking.